Good afternoon. This is Dorothy Simon sitting in for Jim Lakey and it is Friday, May the 31st. The week has gone by very quickly. And you can catch us on Cable Channel 3 or on the web at sandylandcenter.org. sandylandcenter.org. The weather for today. Right now, the sun has burnt off all that fog of the early morning, and it is a bright, sunny 72, and it will be partly cloudy as um, the temperature goes on to a high today of 87. And tonight, the low should be at around 56 degrees. And for the rest of the weekend, there the possibility of more tornadoes, large hail and damaging wind uh, will threaten the, the Midwest and parts of the South. On Saturday it should be sunny and a high of 75 with a low of 49 and the winds at uh, 20, no, 21 miles per hour. And Sunday promises to be very sunny as well, with a high of 77 and a low of 55. And Monday, we could have some isolated thunderstorms with the winds at 18 miles per hour, a high of 83 and a low of 64. So watch out and keep watch for some still stormy weather over the weekend. Um, uh, the Senior Center, the Sunflower Senior Center, will be having its monthly supper on Monday, June the 3rd at 6 p.m. Bring a side dish and come and enjoy some fellowship um, with everyone as they look forward to the regular monthly supper on Monday, June the 3rd. And the Friends of the Library um, has a summer reading program for the kids, kindergarten through fifth grade, and it is dig into, the, into reading. And uh, there's a note here, um, reputedly from Robert Alter, that says, reading is a privileged pleasure because each of us enjoys it. It's quite complex in ways not replicable by anyone else. Um, if you have some time this afternoon, do go by the library also because it's the last day for the Dream Rocket project. Uh, the art display is there at the library. If you have some time, do that. Don't forget to register the kids for the Dig Into Reading summer program and register after June the 1st. Okay. The Senior Center also has a, a trip that is planned for Dodge. It's June the 6th. Uh, there should be some shopping opportunities as they go to the Dodge um, Casino. Uh, the bus will leave at 7 a.m. in the morning, early in the morning at 7 a.m. And they plan to be back here by 3. And um, hopefully by doing that they'll escape some of the summer heat. So call over at the Center at 549-6549 before Ju June the 5th to make reservations as they need um, a good number of people to be on the bus to make that trip. So do call over at the Sandy Man um, Center, the Senior Center, if you want to do that trip to Dodge. And we have some menus uh, Maxwell today is serving roast beef with scalloped potatoes, corn, fruit, and apples, applesauce bar. And on Monday, she will be serving meatloaf, baked potato, beets, cabbage salad, and apricots. And makes me feel hungry when I read these menus. Tuesday, with Swiss steak, potatoes, corn, um, jelly, 
and um, a cherry surprise. So some good eating over at the Maxwell Senior Center. And in St. John here today, they'll be serving chicken tetrazzini, peas, Italian bread, and a tropical fruit salad. And um, plan to have some beef enchiladas on uh, Monday with corn, stewed tomatoes and tortillas, and a pineapple um, tidbits. And on Tuesday, pork cutlet, baked potato, Brussels sprouts with um, roll, and a blueberry crisp. All very enticing and good sounding. A thought for today. For today. Here's food for thought today. The door to the human heart can be opened only from the inside. The door to the human heart can be opened only from the inside. Or food for thought. Thank you and have a good weekend.